Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves somewhere out in Wyoming with a pair of Sovtard brothers who try to get one over on the officers, but it doesn't exactly work out too well for them. And stay tuned for the end of the video when, uh, when they attempt to pay their uh, traffic tickets and, well, the... Uh, the payment is not exactly accepted, so let's go ahead, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. He's smiling, his railroading. Yeah. Can I get driver's license? You already know who I am. Yes. Be on with your day, driver's sir. Driver's license Thank and you. insurance, please. Well, how the hell are they supposed to know who you are if you're not displaying your license plate or even wanting to present your driver's license? I mean, even in Wyoming, you have to present your license at a traffic stop. I mean, come on now, guys. Think harder on this. Do you really want to go through this for the rest of your lives? That's driver's funny. license and insurance. He don't you, need. You, he don't what need. What are to you trying to identify, sir? Will you have your sergeant out here right now, please? Yeah. yeah thank well, you. So if I need your driver's license and insurance. Yeah. I will talk. He don't to need to provide a driver's license if he's not doing license. something for commerce. My boys, you really need to discuss this with the lawyer because you're not really making any good life choices right now. So, uh, what you need to do from here is just. Oh, well, stop drinking the damn soft tart Kool-Aid and get a life, dude. Sir, oh, you are, you just fucked evil. up. Show me your hands. Right you just fucked up. I can't so, find my driver's license. Now what? Okay, What's my do social? Not, do not he doesn't have it. 8119 is my social. You know if, who I am and you're you, railroading me you and you piss me off. Shut my brother's have your door. Get here now. Right fucking you just, now. You so, just illegally right opened now. his door. So I need your driver's license and insurance. What is your hold badge on number? 21. 21 in your name? 21. No, hold on. Jeremy wait a minute. Kemet. Jeremy Kemet. Yes, sir. Oh, wow, Wait a minute. Buddy. Why did you pull me over again? You have expired registration on the vehicle. I need okay. your driver's license. Will you go take a picture of no. that and bring it to me? He doesn't have a driver's time. license. Hold on. Shut I'm trying to door. call. Okay. I'm trying to call somebody right now. It's called 911 because I don't, don't have a driver's license. Need your driver's license. Hold on one sure. second. I'm calling 911. Well, we certainly got a pair of dim bulb soft tarred brothers here. I mean, where do they get this stuff from anyway? Calling the police on the police while they're trying to execute a lawful traffic stop because you have uh, committed vi violations of the traffic law. I mean, come on now. That's not going to get you anywhere at all in life. Being that damn stupid. Traveling for commerce. If you don't provide it, I'm going to remove I you. I will from the when vehicle. I can find oh, it. But you I don't trust are. you. I'm going to remove you from the vehicle if you do not provide me your driver's license and insurance. Oh, I will get out of the get vehicle. All of you rookies okay. out here. Well, that was easy enough to get this soft tart out of the vehicle. Uh, I mean, normally it takes uh, pepper spray, mace, and uh, some wrestling to get them out. But this guy just got up and. Uh, well, he's going to regret it here in a minute anyway, so let's carry on. I don't have to get in there, sir. Get back in your vehicle. I don't have to. It's not my vehicle. Yeah, not exactly a smart move on your part, uh, you dumbass, because, well, for one thing, the cops do have control over the whole scene. If they want the passenger to stay in the vehicle for obvious reasons, such as safety reasons, well, that's what's going to have to happen, because they just can't have an unstable element such as yourself wandering around out there because, you know, sovereign citizens have been known to pull off firearms and, well, off officers. So, why don't you just step back in the vehicle and make them a whole lot safer and sounder? Because that would certainly be nice. I'm going over here to get some lunch. You guys are trying to de detain or obtain my brother, and I'm doing my own stuff. You guys do cannot tell me what to do. Absolutely can't. Absolutely you can't. Okay. Okay. No, you, you can't. No, I won't. Call your sergeant out here. No. Yes. Get back in your vehicle. Call your sergeant out here, turn around, sir. Turn okay. 
I would like for you to call your sergeant. Why? What do you mean, why? Because you don't know the law, sir. Yes, you do. Yeah. No, you don't. We have the ability to control the team. Is there a reason why you guys let, are here? Let go of me. Sir, you ain't even putting the handcuffs on properly. Is there a reason why you're here? Why would you put these handcuffs on? Right, that is very Wow, these two uh, brothers don't even share half a brain between the two of them. And, well, a couple weeks later, one of them decides to go to uh, the court and pay their fines. But he decides to do it in uh, rolls of quarters. And guess what? It gets rejected. Gee, I wonder why. So let's roll that beautiful bean footage. So is it Hi, I'm here to pay my fine. Yeah, uh, I think it would have been easier just to go to the bank and have them exchange that because, well, I'm sure the bank could use some quarters, but these guys, they don't want to be put through the pain and misery of having to count these. You're not going to accept my pay. We Jerry. need to come back with courtesy. We did a favor and courtesy by um, contacting your attorney. This is the way I save my money. You guys want my money. Now you're Jerry. not going to accept it. Jerry. Sir, my name's not Jerry. Gerald? That's right. Please don't touch me. Take these and I'll talk to you. Please don't touch me. So you're refusing my payment? You can have this if you want. I'm asking if you're refusing my payment. We need currency, paper money. This... This is currency. This is a form of currency, ma'am. You have a sign out here that says sure. exact change. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll have my money back. Yeah, you guys always cheat people. Absolutely, I think you cheated me. It's from 2019. You know what? We go back 10 years, at least. I'm sure you do. Maybe you guys should have brought it up before, but I've been in here okay, since then. I don't, I don't need to talk to you. I'll be, I'll be back with cash because that's the way you want. But um, understand that I got it on video that you just refused my payment. Why do you have to lie so much? They didn't refuse the payment. They refused the form of payment. They didn't want to take a bunch of quarters. They wanted something easier like paper money, you douchebag. Okay, because when I take my change to somewhere else, they're going to take a percentage of my change because you guys don't want to take my money. Judge kind of, judge kind of um, gave a break during COVID. That's why, and she's done with the break for COVID. That's why break. I've been in front of Judge Cundiff since then. Thank you, though. I'll be back. You see this sign right here, sir? Yeah, Gerald. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. Please have exact change if paying in cash. Yeah. Did I bring change? Did I bring cash? No, I'm, it ain't about you, you sir. It ain't about you. This is a refusal of payment. Okay, you got a document, you got your change, they want cash. Well, aren't you the dumbass considering that exact change could mean just about anything depending on the context, you bloody moron. It doesn't have to be coin currency. It can be uh, paper currency. Do you get that, 
you moron, or are you just trying to be difficult like a lot of your other soft tar dumbass friends? Well, given what we saw earlier, I think it's the uh, fact that he might be very well uh, stupid. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.